Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm at Butterley Spillway. There's a spillway there, or part of it. And it's a lovely little beauty spot in West Yorkshire. So we're gonna do about seven miles around here today and I hope you are going to join me. And I am breaking the boots in. Now you might have noticed that the audio is a lot better on my last couple of vlogs and that's because I'm using the Rode Video Mic Pro Plus, my best microphone. And I don't see why I shouldn't use the best for you guys. I also am using the Ulanzi power handle and I'm gonna show you this little uh, rig that I've put together. I'm gonna show you that and I'm using it now so I don't have to swap out batteries all the time because I've got loads of power. So I'm like uh, rigged up to the mains almost. So this is a really good rig and uh, I'm enjoying using it. So I'm gonna take a walk up to the top, just up to the top there. And I'm gonna show you this rig that I'm using today for those of you that are interested. quite a climb up there i've just uh, i just climbed all the way up here and it is a gorgeous area this uh, butterly spillway but i am breathing heavy i really am going to have to get the fitness in place for my coast to coast but right now i am enjoying collecting the equipment that i'm going to need and i'm glad that i'm getting your advice i really need your advice along the way and it has helped me well i'm really enjoying this walk there's a bit of a, a woodland part to it as well this is really nice now the boots. Now, what about the boots? Now, the boots uh, feel great so far. First time out today. And as I thought, they're so soft. The leather is so supple. I don't mean soft as in weak. Uh, they feel very strong, but uh, the leather is very supple. And uh, they feel like I've been wearing them for ages, to be honest. Uh, they feel really good. And it is really wet below. You can see some uh, boggy stuff there. Uh, yeah. Plenty of uh, plenty of boggy stuff there for me to try out the waterproofness of them and uh, yeah my feet are bone dry and I'm uh, going through the mud right now so yeah the boots are feeling really good now something that I did forget I forgot to show you this rig didn't I because uh, I'm using the Ulanzi power handle let me just get across this bridge yeah Whoa. tiny bridge not really a bridge. <laughs> okay, let me get down here. I'm going to show you this uh, this rig that I'm using today. And it's because I'm fed up of waiting for the uh, media module. So I've gone back to some uh, better equipment to give you better audio. Because I kept getting caught out, although the internal microphones of the Hero 8 are pretty good. Uh, they're not really good enough. You keep getting caught out with uh, crosswinds and stuff like that. So... Uh, let me show you this uh, this rig that I'm using. So there it is, there's the rig that I'm using today. Now, I have created a rig very similar using the Rode Video Micro, and uh, I thought I would uh, create the best one with my best microphone, Rode Video Mic Pro Plus, and it is a fantastic microphone. I keep the wind muff on it all the time, so as you look around it, you can see that I've got uh, right angle USB to USB-C and that goes into the uh, into the mic adapter, the GoPro mic adapter. And you can see that I've got the, uh, if you've got a Rode Video Mic Pro Plus or a similar microphone, uh, I just came up with the idea of just tucking the uh, mic adapter just into the side of the microphone there. And I think that's a really good solution. So uh, yeah, uh, I have made a similar uh, rig before, but uh, this time using the, Ulanzi power handle is great because every time I look at the uh, battery level it's at 100 percent I'm sure it'll start dropping soon but uh, it's not dropped on me yet so I think this will do for all my vlogs I won't have to swap out batteries and it uh, it hopefully will mean that I don't have to buy the designated GoPro Hero 8 battery. I do have one of course that came with the camera but I've got so many other GoPro batteries for the Hero 7 which do fit in this camera. Um, I'd, I'd rather use them and I'm really happy to be uh, to be back using this kind of equipment uh, because that's why I bought it and uh, you guys deserve the best. This is so uneven here as I'm walking, so uneven. 
But what a view. You must always stop to admire the view. I'll tell you something else about the boots as well. Um, I nearly purchased a pair of Solomon boots. I was really attracted to them. Uh, but I recently went up to Scotland to visit family and friends and uh, my parents had bought me for Christmas these boots that I've got on now, which are the Berghaus Superlight uh, GTX2. And uh, yeah, they're absolutely fantastic. I'm really enjoying wearing them. So I nearly bought a different set and different pair. I was so close to buying them. Uh, but I think these are going to be absolutely perfect. So this is becoming a, a longer walk than I thought. I haven't actually walked around this area before, only down at the very, very bottom part. And I'm really glad that I've come on this walk up here to Butterley Spillway. Really good walk around here and very scenic. Uh, you get a bit of woodland, you get a bit of uh, moorland and uh, yeah, you've got the water as well. And the calming effect of the water is definitely working on me today. It does have a calming effect, a large body of water. So, uh, now these boots, just as I'm coming down here, and it's very, very muddy, very wet and muddy today, the, uh, the tread on these, on these boots has been specially designed so that the mud and the water doesn't uh, stay in the tread, that it just flows straight out. And uh, you might think that when you read it, that's a bit of, uh, a bit of rubbish, a bit, uh, a bit of flannel really, just to sell the boot. But as I'm coming down here, I'm becoming really confident that uh, the sole is not clogged up with mud and I'm getting really good grip. So, uh, so far so good, I'm really, really impressed press with these boots. So it's just started to rain here at Butley Spillway and this is where the uh, water comes in, this is where the river joins the uh, reservoir down there and I'm really glad that I'm using this vlogging setup here because if I was using the internal microphones of the GoPro Hero 8 you wouldn't be able to hear me very well because of the water noise but I'm sure that this Rode Video Mic Pro Plus is picking me up perfectly so I'm really happy with this vlog and we're still on 100% battery because I'm on the Ulanzi power handle so I don't have to worry about power. Now I'm going to cross this uh, across this bit of water and test out the waterproofness of these boots. Is waterproofness an actual word? <laughs> Comments below. Uh, yeah, so uh, not advisable to record yourself crossing a slippery stream like that, but I did it and the boots have held up perfectly. I could feel, I could feel the cold coming through the boots, but uh, my feet are absolutely dry. And that's what you'd expect from brand new boots that I just waterproofed. Uh, so yeah, I know they've got a bit of a ways to go, but I'm breaking them in today and I can't tell you how impressed I am with them. But the thing is, I can tell you, I am really impressed, really impressed with these boots. And uh, first time wearing them, really easy to wear. I do feel like I've had them for a while. So I'm climbing up again. That's where I just crossed down there. And I'm climbing very steep up here. So it's been a really good test, first time out with these boots, really good test because I've had a lot of gradient up and down and we've had the water and the mud. So let's, uh, let's carry on. So if you are looking for a solution for powering your GoPro or really any camera and you don't want to be carrying around extra batteries and uh, this is combined 
within a handle. So it's the Ulanzi, the Ulanzi power handle. And I'll put a link in the description below. Uh, it's a really good solution. This thing's been on for over an hour. I haven't been turning it off in between takes. Uh, so it's just been on all the time and it still says 100% battery. So uh, the power handle hasn't started to drain yet. Uh, I don't think you can use it without a battery and I don't think you can use a GoPro without a battery and so the battery has to be in. So we've got the power of the actual battery and we've got the power of the uh, handle itself. So it's really good, it hasn't drained on me yet. I just switch the camera on and leave it on. If you've got one, tell me how long it will last. How long will this thing last? I suppose I could just leave it on and put a clock next to it and see how long it just stays on. But uh, when you're actually using it, it's different because uh, I know that it drains the battery if you're using like uh, time lapse, uh, time warp and all them features drain the battery a little bit more. So that's really good uh, to know that you've got uh, all this extra power and it's built into a handle. So uh, it's not taking any more room up in your bag. So if you are interested in that as a solution, check out the link below. The Ulanzi power handle, really recommend it. So I've had a fantastic circular walk today. I've come right round, I've gone all the way round. Um, I, started, I started over there, all the way round, right round up over the tops. A really good circular walk and I'm back and I am parked over there. And uh, it's been a great walk. Butterly Spillway, nice walk, really good walk. So that is about it for this vlog. I hope you've enjoyed it. I have enjoyed your company, or of course, that's right, I would have been all by myself. So I'm glad you came along with me. If you've enjoyed this vlog, give me a thumbs up, give me a like, and uh, I upload a vlog every week. So if you haven't already done it, uh, consider subscribing. And check out some of my older videos. Uh, I've done lots of them. I think I'm gonna have to start creating playlists. Uh, so there, there is the spillway down there. That is the actual spillway. That is the actual Butterly spillway. So a nice spot to finish this vlog. So uh, until the next one, bye.